wale ndusi ya wakudu Europe tiani kusa Amerika tiani wale ya eko za vundutu Ani Amerika? Vundutu de madi alo wale ya eko zani kwa logo ana amoresi Dia ke oja de oja ni kombare bana si Afrika kare e doki ruvu ka ovido ama Sudan ya Morongi ama Uganda ama Morongi ama Nigeria ama Angola almadi alo alo ngwe ani de vugide ya mundo of ora chirizi oko tuki bua itulo ngado ya eke suke kare mbalo kuna eko kwa logo ya foitema Ala, ani ani, ba o time ba dira ni ani dira ge. Hello, hello, hello. Hey, Richie, that's me, that's me. What's it? Nee, du, ich bin auf, ich bin auf der ägyptischen Grenze. Wir gehen heute nach Ägypten. Ich glaube, dass du dann da Wind und ich muss mir, du hast echt, echt ein bisschen eine Krise, weil ich muss, der Wind geht los und jetzt habe ich einfach die, die Genehmigung und ich muss weg. Du denkst ja nicht, du bist nicht überhaupt nichts. Du kannst unten, oder was? Scheiße, ich sehe überhaupt nichts. Überhaupt nichts. Yes. Richie, ich muss auflegen. Bitte. Let's go. This isn't the baby, baby game. It's not a baby game, it's the international. And that's about yeah. too much in the baby game. It's a, it's a, it's a, it's a so, socialist. To uh, sleeping. Yes. It's not for sleeping, it's a socialist hymn. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Imagine you are lost in space in a tiny cabin. And when you slowly approach a rather hot planet, your feet and your fingers are freezing. Your spacecraft is in reality a flying tin can. It's a tin can with a motorcycle engine and wings out of fabric. You come closer to this planet, Africa. This is where humans originated. And much later, it was discovered over and over and enslaved and dispossessed and colonized. Colonized by foreigners who had invented maps and compasses, engines, airplanes. Now you may start feeling strange. Strangeness penetrates you. It enters your heart. You recall some sinister memories that you'd prefer to forget. From now on, you're a complete stranger. You're an alien. to take photos for their culture project that is leading them from Egypt along the Nile. Gini giringati arabe mani gorone F J R I X. Alek radio mani chade ki goni i ti arabe. Is it written here that the government of Southern Sudan has no objection? No 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 no. Gini ni abe gini warang e nyuti ni na marwa marge. You are going to, to spend the night here. Yeah. Why? And he said that why? What is the reason of spending because it's, night here? Because it's, in the night we cannot fly. It's impossible to fly at night. That you are going with him to the Buton. I think it is still a problem. It's dangerous.
There was this mighty queen named Victoria. She had never set foot here in Africa. With her finger on the map, she had drawn a line. And in the distance, a line of steel would be cut into the sand. The steel pushed straight south into the continent's heart. And along the tracks came the soldiers and their rifles and the British flag. But also the Queen sent her only god and set him up against someone else's god. And so it went and again the war became holy. Witness the end of Africa's biggest country. It will soon no longer exist. And you meet the two toughest warriors of this poor country, the chiefs, ultimate enemies from decades of civil war. The man in black, Mr. Kier, will be president and military leader of the new South Sudan. He is a freedom fighter, a war hero, and he believes in Jesus. Mr. Kier is a really good friend of the US of A. That's why George W. Bush offered him a cowboy hat. The man on the right, Mr. Bashir, is Sudan's mighty ruler. He is a really good friend of China. He believes in Mohammed. Mr. Bashir is one of the world's most wanted men. Wanted for war crimes, crimes against humanity, and genocide in Darfur, which is nearby. The nation's war machine can only be financed through the exportation of oil. And someone's finger in some faraway country cuts across a map. Very heavy little man. One out of five. Repeat, repeat please. This place is very heavy land mine.
Imagine you can travel in space and in time. Go backwards a hundred years. You are in a place called Flashoda. Imagine it is 1898. On the craters of the moon, no spaceship had ever landed, and no man had ever raised a flag. Even here on the banks of the Nile, no flag had ever been put up. The trees here would not stand in straight lines like soldiers. There were no fences or gates. Fushoda is the epicenter of the colonial scramble. French and British armies have planted their flags here, and at the same time, two grand imperial dreams collide. The British desire to connect the Nile to the Cape, the North to the South, and the French fantasy to possess Africa from East to the West, from the Atlantic to the Indian Ocean. On such crossroads, the villagers must learn many things. How to wear uniforms, how to march in step. The local people have to learn how to need money and how to give up their ancestors' land. The masters from London, Paris or Berlin announce to bring light into the darkness. They draw lines into the savannah Borders that separate resources from people. Borders that divide cultures and tribes. So then, brothers and sisters would fight. This one is the just the tomb of the man. The Piri. The Piri. They shot him. And then again, he was pushing just ahead and he ran somewhere. Those people came again. And then they shot him again. Then he went to for another military training and came back with another gun. He went another, uh, maybe until the three times, different guns. And it is 
through the European when they came here. An African have to, to be given a gun, and then have to shoot an elephant. Then the, the elephant has have to be brought to, to a white man. Mm -hmm. This is the way they started. Mm -hmm. <coughs> After that, when the when the, the partition of Africa, when they made Africa a country, a different countries demarcating it, make a boundary, boundaries, then uh, African have to fight for president. So rebel um, many they came, they went and get some guns from, uh, from some donors uh, and they start rebelling. Uh -huh. Rebelling again uh, the main government to, to, uh, to change president. Because uh, everybody cannot move around because the soldiers come around here tonight. Everybody cannot fight. Yes, sir. Yes, they are right. All people they are right. Because they see the soldiers all, they are very ready. Guys, my God, we say you are Christian or you are Muslim. What do you think? You, you are Christian or you are Muslim. What do you think? I, I thinking because because I am Christian, I need to know you also. Right, I'm not Muslim. Hallelujah. 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 No, no, uh, we don't know how to call our love. We don't know what is love. <laughs> now we're saying hallelujah. Yeah. <laughs> we don't know, we don't, no, no, we don't know how to like, what is how like? <laughs> Most of two million and a half yeah. have died because of Arab. We don't have a fighting. We're staying here for peace. So you protect the oil field? Or? Yeah. You protect? Yeah. There's so many uh, Chinese people, no? Yeah. Yeah, yeah there is so many. Yeah. There's Chinese people in the world. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's Chinese people in the world. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 带music的小韩剧你们要留下来我也留下来如果达不到标准开放标准他就要求我们就是减少排量就往这走走看是不是作业结果我试你可以去看一看<笑> There is also a CPI Central Processing Facility then from CPI to Sudan Park. Now our oil field now produces 300,000 beers per day. Here now the scenery is not very good. The environmental protection or something is their responsibility. Do you have some of these, uh, uh, you know, some, you have some friends in these villages here? Oh, some friends in where? 
No. <laughs> you don't know anybody here? No. They are the local people. You don't, uh, you cannot communicate with them? Perhaps they didn't uh, say English and also. Uh, I think they are friendly. Yeah. No problem. But if no soldier, we, we should keep them in the, the camp. There's no problem, I think. This area, nothing happened. But we should keep the safety. Uh, more safety. Uh, everything here is good, you know. I hope Sudanese, I like Sudan, I like uh, everything here. This oil now you check. Anything is good for this. No need USA, you know? No need USA here. <laughs> sure. Uh, you know, because USA, you know, big problem for this area, you know? Big problem for me, for uh, all, all Sudanese here, for, you know? Yeah. Now USA talk too much for, uh, for base and uh, like this. Yeah. Sure, you know? Why? Uh, no need. Why are they talking about it? Because of Sudan. Because yeah. of Sudan, yeah. Sudan, yeah, yeah. USA need cut for Sudan, but no, no, no like, no like in America here. No like this. All Sudan is one. Hello. Hello, your mom? That is a temple. Temple? Yeah, what Muslim is temple. The, maybe Arabic is Moscow. Mosque, yeah. Yeah. Mosque, yeah. For the pre. Yeah. 
Colonize the southern yeah. right now. We have, we have to break away. Yeah, yeah then. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 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 Indukumpinasi <laughs> Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Be yang sukar de, bermut. Aji zul berkhusus film moye dah, bermut awal. Ya wuna nene jiran naya nak jangan rale nene jangan ini. That water, if you you touch it, you going to to die. If the animals drink that water, also is going to die. If the kid touch that water, also is going to die. <laughs> Captain Cuber, you know that uh, it's an American uh, president. Said, I have a dream. <laughs> What was the name of the president? Ah, amazing. Thank you, Arma. This is our shelter. Put it in the proof. Yeah, put it in the proof. Which planet do you come from? It seems like you go to Africa before. Before, yeah, the Europe. The same thing. You must yeah. find a place that nobody lives there. Then exploit. That's the idea. If yeah. you go to other planets, they have also the local living. Yeah, so it's you, science you, you destroy that. It's yeah. something like before he goes to Africa. Europe, you, you, Europe people, people they go to the Africa. That's yeah, yeah. yeah. well, that's the last one. Mm. You find a place that nobody, mm. nothing there, only energy. 
only a mind there. You only are just to extract the energy. I'm taking the direction of the body. Gently speaking, I say a sentence. Don't be afraid to communicate with outside world. Chinese has already had such a sentence. 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 就是说，你跟他文化不认识不一样，道德观念不一样。你要去外太空，第一你要保护自己，去其实很危险，你不知道有什么东西，有可能它的科技就是非常超越过你。就飞碟就用的是反物质发动机，你知道什么叫反物质发动机？对对对，它是存在风尚不稳定。其实我第一次发现，那时间很短，嗯，不可能的。嗯，那你刚才说的带武器这点，我认为，如果要生存。肯定得有，就有竞争，对，有竞争，就有斗争，你得起码有斗争，就得有武器，武器合适，最先进的武器，最最最好的武器就是这个。我我我来说两句吧。他说那个在脑袋那个武器是挺好的，啊So you see the various Nuer tribes here, the various Dinka tribes here, and uh, the groups like the Zande and uh, Kakwa, and various Bari groups in this in this area. There was a lot of work to do inside the South to unify it uh, as a political entity and, and to provide security, common security throughout. So what's going to happen next, I mean, 10 years to go? Well, oil will continue. There are oil concessions throughout this, this area. The primary air, oil producing areas are uh, actually up in this area and in this area here. But, yeah, but there's exploration going on uh, in Jongle State and concessions throughout that bulk of southern Sudan. And so oil will be a big part of our adjusting now in, in uh, facilities in order to, to help uh, see that that period through. It's a, it's a, it's a symbol of um, commitment to, to southern Sudan in the post-referendum period. Yeah. And I think that it's seen very well by the government and other people here. Mm. We're, we're here to support, so I think it's a, it's a good step forward. In this area is the headquarters. And the uh, high security. Yeah. Tower with a right. safety ice cream. <laughs> it's, a, it's a proposal for my daughter, yes. Is it really? Yeah. She, she came in and looked at the model and decided there were a few things missing. <laughs> and she said that number one was the ice cream shop, and number two was the basketball court. If you know you have registered, you need to vote during the referendum, because if you don't vote, then you may be the one to cause the problem or you if it is going to be either secession or unity if you don't vote then you sh you should be count uh, responsible for that one vote that you do uh, not my vote. last message to all the people of southern sudan is this mm -hmm. we must not allow the enemy to divide us on the tribal basis and we must vote for our total independence. I'm not afraid to say this as Southern Sudanese. I want a total 
independent for our people. And we must not use guns against ourselves. We must prove that we are the people who are able to manage our own affairs and we do not need anyone to come and mis mess up again. Are all charged with war crimes for their actions in Darfur. So the obvious question is why should we care? What happens in Sudan matters very much to us now, economically. Yes, sir, welcome. Good evening, dear Miraya listener. Welcome to the monthly press briefing of the head of the United Nations mission in Sudan on this southern sector, Mr. David Grisley. Reports of major troop buildups on either side of the north-south border appear to have been exaggerated, and the movements we've seen to date have involved units on the scale of the human level. We're now less than 72 hours away from the referendum, and everything appears to be on track. As of last Monday, our UN police had provided referendum security training to over 22,000 officers in VIP security, as well as special weapons and tactics. <laughs> these white buildings right there, yeah. Yeah. these are the residents that are being built over here on what? Or what? Where we're going to our houses. Who are you? Well, my name is David. <laughs> for the U.S. David of the U.S. This is where you started with a tent, right? That's right. One tent. One backpack and one laptop. This is our new cargo aircraft. Yeah, we're going to get it. <laughs> we get to the UN sticker here. For you. Kristen, I know you're jealous right now. I'll tell you all about it a little bit later on. We found the perfect spot for you. Who is Christine? <laughs> for my daughter. She wants to set up an operation here. Really? Yeah, yeah. An operation? Yeah, she wants to set up a safari camp. Really? Yeah. Okay. So seriously. Rocket. See, in this country, you find things from all over the world. Yeah. American mines, British mines, South African, Iraqi, Iranian, Russian, Chinese, Yugoslavian. And a guy walked onto our camp and said he's got a bomb. Hopefully, it'll be a bomb as well. Hopefully. Hopefully, yeah. Where's this? Keeps me working. This is the thing I find most of. You find masses of them everywhere. These are quite common. I found one of these two days ago. Yeah, my name's Silver Rosa. So, which people are in danger? Yes, they're locals. Yeah. Because they, they may not know anything. They don't know what is seen on in the ground. They don't know what is in the mind. Uh, they don't know what is in the ground. They may not know. But even me, I, I don't know either. <laughs> how, how can they know? <laughs> they believe if they're going to get blown up, then it's God's will that uh, they get blown up. Twelve years in the British Army, yeah. I was in the Royal Engineers. Um, going out to Iraq. Yeah, I've been to Iraq twice. First time 
during the war, but in 2006 I went out with one disposal doing this job basically in the army. Are you sure there are no mines here? Yeah, it's not the mines here. No mines, the only bombs, is it? Yeah, it, it was a barrack anyway. What? Here, nothing. Uh -huh. Are you sure? Yes. Now, uh, what, are you, what are you thinking about now, just now? Yeah, I can think about war, but we are now forgetting because we are now in peace. Yes. Yeah. This is my first video I made last season. Time that people have are met and socialising times and demolitions and things. That's kind of, it's a contrast. Let's get that here. Just socialising, and chilling around by pools and things and in bars, and then out in the field where I'm, I'm doing this. Yeah, I think his mummy needs to tell him not to... Uh -huh. Tell him what? She needs to tell him not to stand on landmines, be careful. This is the mother. I've got three women and two guards. Uh, we need armed guards here. This, the theft is quite bad. Um, the first night, the police nearly shot a man stealing from the tent. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, they, sometimes they see others, see what we do. And they want that. But, I don't know. Are they capable? Yeah. There must be a reason they're still 200 years behind the rest of the world. Yeah. They don't want to, maybe. President has ordered his troops to cleanse rebel forces from a disputed area. President Bashir is already wanted for war crimes over genocide in Darfur. Now he's being accused of another deliberate policy of ethnic cleansing. This latest conflict is taking place along the new frontier between what will soon be a divided Sudan. Distressing images show the aftermath of attacks on villages in the new Divide and rule. Mondo, Chocolo, America, go, Colo, British, Colo, German, Colo, Chinese, Sai, Aidina, Siasa, Bako, Janito, Dia, Cas, Naa, Niamala, John, Rea, and African leader. Adia, and I support Africa, Africa, Conjidu, our. Kojo do a malida lo sona yo ba madi bara ko eonji bara ko eonji kake ba onji re sapo ki ande do ko e monikini inde vru vru ni inde ko inde raya ni ni ko ofido e do ni lida lo sore e okpo. I've had it, you are. You're the TRC, you're the pop.
Hey brother, what are you doing? Wait a minute, wait a minute. Wait a minute. So where are you from? Oh. I'm from the S planet. Are you sure? <laughs> We're in the Earth planet. Yeah. A group of the nine planets, such as uh, Mars planet, yeah. Eh? Yeah. then Mercury planet. Yeah. You know Mercury planet? Yeah, I know it. Mercury planet? Yeah. Seems to you don't know. I know it. Ah. Eh? And Jupiter. Uh, seems to me a colonizer. If you are a person who comes to take a country which not belong to him, yeah. Maybe even the appearance of the, the people there, no, no, very different, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. A person who is a colonial government, this is using the people where? Peacefully or by violence? You tell me. I want to understand from you. No, I'm asking you. <laughs> you ah. tell me. Hey, Bad plane. So you you know a lot of bad planes, huh? Yeah, bad planes. You know a lot a lot of things about planes, huh? No, no, you say bad planes. No, you know a lot of things about planes. I know nothing. Uh, uh, the president of Sudan was invited by the International Criminal Court for war crimes and crimes against humanity in Darfur. Harbor, Harbor, let me ask you. Just before I go further, Mr. Herbert, if a president attempt a coup attempt, he is a criminal or not a criminal? I don't know. No, no, you are, you are, you are. Okay, if a president commit a crime, there we have many followers and he rule the government. Yeah. That means the whole, the whole government are cri criminals, isn't it? Yeah, maybe, yeah. That may be. Yeah. That is okay, exactly. Yeah. Correct or not correct? Yeah, I think so, yeah. You think so? Yeah. I'm so that means you're not quite sure. I'm learning from you. I'm, I'm not learning. learning. Yeah. Even I gather from books, maybe books yeah. lie to me. Where is the evidence? I don't, I I don't have full evidence to, but, to... But I'm not from this country. You know, I'm a foreigner, so I don't know that. Isn't it? Yeah. But France have good roots here inside Sudan. France? Yes. Why? Why, Why I'm saying like this, you can get other things belong to... You get uh, like big guns. Yeah. Huh? Big guns. Uh -huh. You get made in France, made in France. Uh -huh. How can that come? Some big guns come here. Do do our people stolen it or friends they brought here or in history friends uh, soldiers were buried here and what? How comes about? They bring guns. I have to be quiet, I will not say anything. The British established the constitution of the Sudan. They, they carry a Bible in the right hand and they carry guns in the left hand. Yeah. And they come and take all our goods and leave. For future leaders, which is uh, Americans, British, China, let them not forget that. God will, will uh, give our children the help. Uh, they will give them uh, a clean brain. They will revenge one day in a different way. So these British let them know that their great great children they will not have access to come to Africa. And Americans too they let them know that their great great children they will not have access to come to Africa. And China too, and French, because these children are growing up. Mm. Of course, the human beings they have brains. They will come up with different solutions. Mm.
every human being has a dignity of living, but they forgot about that. My education is, is not, I'm not in a level of uh, university. I finished my student school certificate. But of me being in America in 16 years, mm. I know a lot. You know, I know a lot. Our people have been deceived. Yeah. Even the military, they talk to you according to the military level. Not everybody's military, mm. you know. And then I will blame our top people. They don't have, yeah. wait, they don't take, they don't take the pictures. Yeah. I was in my first year senior. Uh, we have a song to our politicians. We call them, these are the poor politicians. What do you mean a song? You had a song? Yeah, I have a, I have a song, but, um, um, you know, a song has to be written down and then you can sing it perfectly. But what is it, more or less, what is it about? Um, it was about, uh, my land, my land, my land, my land. In my land, there's much rain. In my land, there's more sun. My land is evergreen and lovely. Our poor politician has denied our rights. Our poor politicians has denied our rights, my land. And then after when we sung that song, there is becoming a problem. And then some of our students, they were arrested. Some of them were beaten to death in a place called uh, Bethel Abiyat. Uh, in English, they say the White House. So some of them were locked up. We don't know where they are. And then... So that's why you had to leave America? That's why I have to leave Juba completely. Because of the song? Because of the song. Because um, we, we try our best, but we always fail. But maybe this, this time, maybe we will uh, achieve something out of this referendum. Thank <laughs> you. 
Welcome to BBC World News. South Sudan has now formally declared its independence. The Declaration of Independence was read before tens of thousands of singing and cheering people. <laughs> Christian nation in this part of the African continent. It, this, it's not like Oklahoma or any, any other place I've been. The um, government is surveying the land. And they don't really understand. The Tupos are much like the American Indians. They don't understand property ownership the way you and I do. <laughs> I guess God is just calling Texans to Sudan. <laughs> We're pretty happy here. The, the climate is pretty similar. So, yeah. So we do we do well here. We're, we're happy. They want to sing to sing the national anthem, the South Sudan national anthem. It's the newest nation in the world. Yeah. <laughs> yes, Christian nation. Yeah, New Texas. Let's go sing song national anthem. Oh God, we praise and glorify. Oh yeah. I want to tell you all that I am very proud of you. You know, we want to teach you about reading and writing and arithmetic. But more importantly, we need leaders who are young men and women of God. Who trust in God and know that He will answer your prayers. When what I want is what God wants. That means when I pray, I'm praying just like Jesus prayed. So that you believe that whatever you pray for, God will do. But you know what the first requirement is for God to answer your prayers? First, you must allow him to change your heart. Your heart has to change. You wouldn't think in today's world that kids would run around naked, eh? Holding a stick. Mata, good eye. Jump. Yeah. She's your neighbor? She lives up there at the village. This is okay. Yeah, it's okay. It's okay. I'm on. I'm on. Walker, come to our mat. Look at the bun. What? What? We started the house 2009. Is the land belongs to the mission or to me? We've got like a 99 year What's it? You get a snake or. How did the locals react to this? Oh, they loved it. Yeah, they were excited. Because yeah. they were able to help. Like none, they none of them were kind of, you know, 
This is our land. There were a few. There were a few because when they put a fence around it, they said this is where our goats normally eat. And I said, well, I'm sorry, but now your goats are going to have to eat outside the fence. Yeah. Oh, no, 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 no. We were here first. I'm like, you were here first, but now there's a fence here. So <laughs> they got over it. It's the leader? Mm -hmm. What is he goat in his head? It's the solar powered Bible. <laughs> <laughs> Of you don't have the picture, do you? Oh, no, it's just audio. Ah. For obedience to Jesus Christ. You teach them how to listen to God's word, word. how to... Grace and peace are yours in Hey, Mom. Can I show you something real quick? Sure. Hey. Hey, She's a good God wants to protect them, and um, and yes, there are all these evil forces at work here, um, and that's real. It's not imaginary. It's real. God spoke to me and said, if you're going to stay in Sudan, you must go and pray with those children, yeah. where we minister to the spirit, to the body. You know, we bring in clothes whenever we can. Yeah, and uh, so when I first started coming here, there was like very little clothing out in the villages. The, the kids would come, some in clothing, some in naked, you know, kind of clothing optional. And it, they just don't care. It's for their health. I mean, you you go 25 kilometers, or 40 kilometers north, 25 miles north of where we're setting, and there are people that literally have no clothes at all. You know, and really the cultural things that we're trying to change are the only only the things that are against the Bible. When I tell the story of the creation, it says at the beginning they were naked and they were not ashamed. <laughs> A large percentage of the people I'm telling the story to are naked. So well, I'm not going to talk about being, I don't want to talk, uh, well, how shall I say this? 
Let's do it one more time. See, it's uh, solar powered. Can we just let's show it? Thank you, sir. So, so. so, when the woman saw that the tree was to be desired to make one wise, she took of its fruit and ate. Then the eyes of both were opened, and they knew that they were naked. Among the trees of the garden, the Lord God called to the man and said to him, He said, Get out of the garden, get out of the garden. Can you jump? Show me how you sing. I told you. Hey, you want to show me how you dance? Can you sing? Pan down. Is it clear? Okay. Hand down. Single distant take. Hand down. Double distant take. She's ashamed without the uniform. If I could go back and I'd be like you. Uh-huh. I'd be your pair. Well, maybe you can tell them which way they are all beaten. Huh? They, huh? they all say that they were beaten because of uh, not having school uniform. Is it clear? 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 Is it what do you think? <laughs>
there's only one fan. Yeah. Oh. That is uh, and that what you come you come with from Nairobi? No, from, from France. Ah come on, no. 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 From France. Hey, you are landing here. But he's landing. <laughs> No, 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 no. <laughs> now, I live in the real world. Uh, there are many different ways of investing. We want, when people come to Africa and make investments, we want them to do well. We also want them to do good. This raises the question, do you believe that China is an important role model? It is easy, and we saw that during colonial times. It is easy to come in, take out natural resources, pay off leaders, and leave. We don't want to see a new colonialism in Africa. No. We, don't want we are interested that somebody will come who do something good for the community. Like what? Like, 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 for example, you are coming, you are coming to make, to make clean water. Okay. You are coming to to make a water company like this one. Okay, you are coming to also to to cultivate, to teach people. To, we have we have a farm. Huh? We're going huh? to help what? the community. It's welcome. Can you we make an effort? Huh? Can we make an effort? Oh, air, air, airport. Yeah. Wow, that is very good. Airport. You see, airport. How many staff is going to work there? Cleaners. Yeah. Yeah. That's good. We're making an effort, and your people can clean it. Yes, my yeah. people will work on it. Yeah. They can give you the land. Give it. Yeah? Just give it. Yeah, they can give you the land. They can give you the land. Free. Free. Even the government, the government will take just uh, something like very low price. The, just to make uh, to make it a document. To make it to document it, to make it document. To but that's not corruption, is it? No, no. No, no, no. No, they're not, that is not, where is the corruption here? There's no corruption here. Because we are investing money to the for the long run. Are we doing that to make money? Oh, creatures of the wind And wild is the wind States of America. I'm delighted to congratulate the organizers of this timely event. The, the Capuensa power plant can today serve approximately 725 customers through 20 kilometers of completed electric lines. In the future, we'll be able to serve Local community members provided much of the labor required to build this plant. Their sweat and dedication to be a permanent part of the electricity that flows through the This morning, in the north, there have been several references to light. 
During the opening prayer, Reverend Charlie talks about light. The county commissioner, in his remarks, also spoke of the importance of light. The children sang songs of light. Those remarks, those references to light, were literally and figuratively appropriate because today we are literally and figuratively bringing light okay are we ready everybody ready for a photograph <laughs> South Sudan, the world's newest country, about 10% of the nation's land has been sold for foreign investors. The United Nations humanitarian coordinator, Liz Grant, said the food, sorry, said the food security situation in, in the country is alarming. It looks like one third of the entire population of South Sudan is food insecure and unfortunately the situation is worsening.
Kau boleh dia duduk di kaca pakai kaca. Tano de tamulo, tano de giris eron, tano gai kileron naga naga kau, naga naga giris giris eron. Alo bangkulu, ada koma. Lada. Lada, maja. Malta, okuma, okuma, okuma ini. Okay. What he says is that this place is belongs to government. The government is going to bring a tractor and it will demolish all these small tokens. Mafi maha. Mahal mafi. Anak mafi. Minat nak kerja hari jual je lah. Minat nak kerja ni semua mahal. Jen kain bukan ini. Nanti ni ada dapat nak. Apa tu sih? Apa tu sih? Ada jual kan nade. Jen kain ni. Kain dah pun aku ada. Hasan was. Ia ada. Has died. Hasan was died. It was uh, been dumped there. Even this place is dangerous for them to live inside. Why? Because uh, it is uh, maybe this one. It's a place for burial of people. Give you properly. Yeah. All of here down mm. the song, the song for the dead. Mm. The God is snow. Mm -hmm. Even I give you wrong, the God is snow. Mm. Here it is song for the dead. All of them. <laughs> Là, à Saint-Sunou Là, à Saint-Sunou. Là, à Saint-Sunou. Là, à Saint-Sunou. Là, à Saint-Sunou. Là, for death. I'm a commander of thousands of troops. <laughs> thousands of troops. 35,000 troops. Hmm? Yeah, yeah. Division. Oh, I'm a and of course, he has been a lot in leadership. He had been also a governor of Lake State, had been a minister also. And now he is the deputy speaker in the uh, South Sudan Legislative Assembly. And we thank you so much, Honorable, for taking your time and speaking to your people out there. My message to our people, first we are liberated. 
we are no longer slaves, we are the first class. But the first class must work. If you don't work, no one can feed you. It is written in the Bible that if you don't sweat, you will not reap. The money is in our hand, as the president said. But your land is... Very fertile and very big. Yeah. That's why some people say that when God made Sudan, he laughed. What a big land without mind to develop it. Uh -huh. It has happened. Uh -huh. We are not thinking. They say, my land, my land. To do what alone? My share the land with other people who have technology to exploit it. There is no mechanization here. Uh -huh. Just trees. <laughs> yeah. Let us bring more awareness to our people. Mm. Not to refuse on the land. When we say this land is given to investors, they should accept it. They so that we have large mechanized areas of five miles. That would be a very big foot. So like they have to give the land. On, yeah. which, on which basis to yeah. give the land, for instance? Yeah. Am I giving it forever to this particular no, no, person? No, no. Then what will happen to the future you, of the generation coming to the You don't the sell the land. You don't sell it. You lease it. Mm -hmm. uh, six is the maximum for big thing to be done. A factory, for example, a factory. Six is the... Yeah, six years. A factory. Because factory will pay it back. Hmm? Yeah. You cannot sell your land. No. It's only lease is the law. Mm -hmm. do, do you know a song huh? called Do you know a song huh? which was sang a long time ago called My Land? Huh? My Land, a song. That my the, Land, song, my land. Song. my land. My Land, My Land. Mm. You don't know it, huh? Yeah, there are so Ooh, many songs in our There are very many songs. Like, there are many songs in my from my battalion. You want the national anthem? Yes. And we will stand now. Mount Chief. Copper seal, a Okay. Uh, the community was accusing him that he had sold the land yet. Uh, 
go money from America. Because they made these things a proposal, and the same the one made these things with, with these people from the USA, with, with, the, with, the consum, with, with the our consumption from the community. This, this country was uh, destroyed by the people. Liars, people come and, and they want to kill me. That I have sold the land. Yet I did not sell. No document. The, 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 the contract. Mm. Yeah. Signed by those people who are ministers of Nile trading and development. Page would drive Dallas, Texas, USA. Mm. How big is the land? Yeah, very big, very big place. <coughs> The 600,000 hectares. Mm. Government of South Sudan. Okay. Uh, NTD has full rights to exploit all natural resources in the leased land. This includes one, right to develop, produce, and exploit timber, forestry, resources on the leased <coughs> land. <coughs> Three, right to engage in agricultural activities, the cultivations of bifoil crops and palm oil trees. Four, right to exploit, explore, develop, mine, produce, and all exploit, uh, exploit uh, petroleum, natural gas, and other hydro, uh, hydrocarbons resources for both local and export markets mm. for 75 thousand Sudanese pounds equivalent to approximately US dollars twenty-five thousand. Did you know what it means? The document. I didn't do in a gondos do mother in a do not do mother on you. I do I don't know the document. They said give me this they just told you sign. I say they sign. The men were people are signed. You, you are the last. You said. Okay. Because other people are above have signed. Ah, yeah. I see. Did they explain you why to sign or? They don't explain. No, they are, they say they will come to to the contract. To uh, make the development. For the development. They say you have to sign to have development. Yeah. yeah. You more than that. Whoa. Mm. Did you fight yes, sir? Hmm? Did you fight? Yes. Yeah. Twenty-one years. You were fighting? We are fighting. In the Arabs. They are men. In the group. The, the Arabs, what did they want? Hmm? What did they want, the Arabs? The Arabs? Yeah. They're shooting us. They want to take our land to, to be the, theirs. Excellencies and Honourables, Ministers, MPs, and members of the diplomatic court, investors, business communities, we want to attract investment in our new bond nation. When you come and invest in a place like this, make sure that you are going to do development for the country. It's not about... It's not about coming to make a big but quickly. It's about developing the country and the consequence of that is you will make a big but when you take it back. I'm not a businessman for now. South Sudan is a country that desperately needs help. And the, it's not, well, not something to be ashamed of well, to make a profit at the same time. It is also one of the mineral producing areas in Africa also. Put it differently. The bird that wakes up early is the one that normally has the opportunity to pick the grasshopper or the moth. Most of the arable land left on the planet is in Africa. More and more, the world will look to Africa to be its breadbasket. And 
I hope that it is Africans who will profit from becoming the world's wealthiest. <laughs> yeah. And because of our link to the SPLA, yeah. we, we have an armed license and we mentor and train them. A lot of them very uneducated because they went into the bush at the age of 14. Mm -hmm. And so we're trying to bring them on. And yeah, so what do you actually do? The South Star Business Council was set up by uh, Brigadier James Ellery, and he um, was UN director here in 2007 and loves the country uh, very much. Yeah, we have tried to get hold of the Ministry of Defense, but okay. they have been. They will be interested. They will be Italian level camp, complete camp with electricity, ablution system, uh, mess hall for dining. We'll pick up all this uh, signature and then the profile of the missile or rocket being fired. And then it's a question about uh, not interfering with the pilot's work because he's flying. So you as a pilot would not notice what you want. You may feel uh, the detonation somewhere else. The system makes sure that you are not hit by a missile, incoming missile. Ah, what, what does it work? Just to protect the um, presidential planes or VIP planes. Live with us yeah. and feel this is your second home, like what our minister yeah. said. Oh, we just what? say, yeah, <laughs> we kind of want to be part of you. We want to, we want to be growing with you. Thanks for that. I would because hope that people would embrace this is a philosophy that Native Americans have. Nobody owns any of this. We just borrow it for our lifespan. Yeah, and we should give it back in a better condition than we got it in. So if people view South Sudan in that way, then it will be right for the South Sudanese and it will be right for the investors because it's completely win-win. There are heart rate concerns, you know, aerial bombardments near the border areas are going on, as well as in Darfur, in North The world's Sudan. newest nation is preparing for war. Thousands of soldiers are already on the new border. This is over oil and land to the border. We don't want it to be to be flowing into pockets of others. It must flow to us in South Sudan. So it is a war that is being imposed on us again. I said many times that I don't want to tell you that the war. But they are looking for it. Thank you. 
Climate change is calling a serious threat to peace and security in the region. And that's combined with an ongoing humanitarian crisis in the South, where it estimates that 120,000 people are in need of aid, and that's because of the wave of ethnic clashes there. Then, of course, there's war and famine in Somalia, which has also dominated this year's summit. That country has been in a state of anarchy for months and years. The sun may reach for the stars, others will end behind bars, what the future has in store. It's too late to regret what is gone will be no more. Tomorrow is my turn. No more doubt, no more fears. Tomorrow is my turn when my love is returning all these years I've been learning to save fingers from burning tomorrow is my turn no more doubt 
it's no more fears tomorrow is my turn to receive without giving to make life worth living for it's my life that I'm living and my only concern